Hi, this is an example absolute value problem from the AMC, so let's see what we have. Suppose that absolute x plus y plus absolute x minus y is equal to 2. What is the maximum possible value of this expression? Well, this problem is difficult because the absolute value equation shown is hard to sort out. But fortunately, this equation matches one of the prototype forms found in the tutorial linked in this video. So we can construct the graph of this equation to be a simple square of side length 2 centered at the origin. So let's draw that out under our problem. We have x, y axes, tick marks at 1 and 2. And the graph of this equation that we saw from the tutorial is a simple square of side length 2 centered at the origin. Now once we know that, the rest of this problem is actually pretty easy to sort out. It looks like we're trying to maximize this expression which contains x squared, minus 6x, and plus y squared. So let's try to maximize the y squared contribution. And that's pretty easy. We just have to choose y to either be plus 1 or minus 1. To maximize the x squared contribution, we want x to be either minus 1 or plus 1. But maximizing the minus 6x contribution, well, that's pretty clear. We need to make x equal to minus 1. So it seems like the points we need to choose to maximize this expression are the, either the upper left corner or the lower left corner. So let's pick the upper left corner where x, y is equal to minus 1, 1. And then this expression is just equal to 1 plus 6 plus 1, which is equal to 8 for choice D. Now what if we didn't recognize this equation graph from our list? How can we decipher this equation graph quickly? Well, we can deconstruct this graph using the symmetry arguments and you can see this explained in the supplemental problem set linked in the description section. Hope that helps and we'll see you at the next video. Take care. Bye-bye.